I had a request from a YouTuber in France to use the Epson R2400 with roll paper. Well, I don't have any roll paper, but I think we can simulate how to use it. I've been reading up on the uh, user's manual, which was a, a major thing to just find. And let's open this up here. It says to open this up, push this back in and pull these out first. Okay. And now I'm going to turn this around so I can work on the back side. Okay, now it says to install the rollers. Let's see. Yeah, this is the one with the arrow is on the... Let's see here. Oh, they go on... Ah, this way. Okay, so... Find that slot. And there is no choice there. That one must go there. That's the one with the arrow on it. Okay. And this one will go on the next size. You can see the slots there for the size roll that you're using. There we go. Okay, now of course you'd have the paper roll in there. Now what I did was I cut down uh, a sheet of paper. Uh, the roll is 8.3 inches wide and the paper is, that I'm going to use was 8.5 so I just cut off just a small portion on the side so it'll fit in there. Okay, I'll have to take a look at the instructions again. I may need to turn power on, but you can see that the paper will fit in there. You'll just have to consider it as a very short roll of paper. And as I push it in there, it sounds like a switch or something. So I'm going to hook up the computer, which I have. Uh, disconnected and we'll turn power on and we'll see what happens. Okay, I've now turned this thing sideways on here so I can and I've got the computer hooked up. The printer's not on yet. So let's turn the printer on. ran it all the way through. Let's wait until it stops. It needs to clean the heads. Okay, that seems to be happy. Let's try this again. Okay, that time it moved the paper right up to the beginning. Okay, it's still cleaning the heads. So don't jump the gun here. Oh, that must be it. No, nope, not yet.
Oh, there it is. Wow, that was very interesting. Like I said, I've never used that before. Okay, let's see if there's any sticking out. Well, okay, I don't want to run out of paper, so I'll print a 4x6 of this. That way that should ensure that I don't run out of paper. And I'm going to bring up something to print. Print this all. Go in here to print. This is uh, Photoshop Elements 4, by the way. And I'm going to keep things as source as. But, uh, and you can see I've got it set up for 9.9 .9 and 8. But we need to go to page setup. Portrait. We need to change that to roll. Um, and let's do 4 by 6. Portrait. Yeah, that'll be good. Let's see what that looks like. Okay. I don't really care uh, what it looks like. We'll tell it to squash things later. Uh, but there's the roll, 4x6. Go ahead and print. We'll get another window. Ah, here it is. Yeah, go ahead and make it fit. Okay, now in properties, we're going to need to make sure that it says roll and it's actually uh, going to be on premium luster and I don't want enhanced uh, 4x6 I shouldn't run out of paper because I don't want to spray on the equipment and let's see advanced high speed no let's do low speed that'll give me a chance to uh, stop things if I need to and let's see can't uh, go ahead I'll go back to basics nothing's changed there go ahead okay now print okay I always ask for a preview window that looks okay well let's print that and let's see what happens Well, you're supposed to be able to back up the paper by pushing this button. Oh, wow, it came out. Let me show that. It came out down here. That's real interesting. Because I put it in, not going to be able to see this, but I put it in right up here. Okay. And yes, I'm glad that I decided to go with a little bit smaller print, but that demos uh, how to set up the rollers. And of course, if I had a roll of paper there, you would just continue printing. And you wouldn't uh, mess with the uh, uh, paper until you were done. And then you'd cut it. Well, I hope this helps. If you have uh, any more problems, uh, uh, don't hesitate to give me an email or a comment. I have a high resolution picture link of the Adobe settings in the description of this video.